sealing containers. One of the most important election inspector duties is properly sealing the ballot container at the end of the night. All ballots that were delivered to the precinct must be accounted for on the ballot summary and contained in the ballot container at the end of the night. This ensures all ballots are available in the event of a recount. Sealing and recording of the sealing of the container properly certifies that the election inspectors were the last to handle the official ballots. If the container can be opened, or if the seal number is not properly written down in the poll book and on the ballot container certificate, the integrity of the ballots inside that container is compromised, and that precinct is unrecountable. To repeat, a ballot container that is not properly sealed makes your entire precinct unrecountable. Ballot container and seal types vary across the state, but no matter which approved seals or containers you use, you can ensure your precinct is recountable by verifying three things. One, that all of the ballots, voted, unvoted, spoiled, and original, but not provisional envelope, are inside the container. Two, that the container cannot be opened in any way once sealed. Three, that the seal number is written properly both in the poll book and on the ballot container certificate. Let's review the mistakes often seen at recounts and how to check whether your container is properly sealed.